So here's a question we get asked a lot. Um, do silicone implants make people sick? And as of 2019, there are no viable statistics or studies that show that there's a connection between implants and making people sick. There's one exception which I want you to know about. It's a little bit of a longer video, so please bear with me. BIA, ALCL, or breast implant associated anaplastic large cell uh, lymphoma is a, a disease process which is gaining recognition, but I'd like to put things in perspective, okay? In the United States alone, there's roughly 400,000 uh, breast implant cases a year, roughly 100,000 reconstructive and 300,000 um, aesthetic or cosmetic breast augmentations, okay? In the world literature, there is somewhere between three to 5,000 total cases of BIA ALCL. And to date, not a single one of them has identified smooth uh, implants as a cause. They've all been related to either textured implants or we just didn't know what, uh, whether it was textured or smooth, but to date there's been zero evidence that saline, or sorry, that smooth shelled implants cause this BIA ALCL. Now I'm gonna explain a little more about what it is and what to do about it in a subsequent video, so please stay tuned. This was just an overview of what it is and the fact that BIA ALCL in the world literature has been associated with textured implants. Thank you very much.